Hey guys, this is a project for an instrumentation and measurement lab. Um, the criteria for this project is that it must contain sensors, a motor, interact with the user, and it must be standalone. For the motors, we have four motors. Here you can see um, two bipolar stepper motors. We have this one right here and then this one right here. Um, one mo of the uh, stepper motors goes along the y-axis. The other one goes along the x-axis. The other two motors are DC motors. This one that you see right here, that controls the pulley uh, with a string, which that string is uh, lowers the claw. You see right here in this demonstration. The other DC motor controls the claw, uh, closing and opening the uh, arms of this. Here is uh, one sensor, and then you can kind of see the second sensor, if I were to um, point a light right at it, you can see it inside there, and that's a photocell sensor. The two sensors are also its interaction with the user, so this joystick right here, you can move it down, up, left, right, and that'll control the, the claw to move in that same direction. And then when you press the button, it will all be automated from there, which will pick up whatever uh, um, is at the location you move the claw to. We'll pick it up and we'll move it to its original starting position and then drop it right next to that leg right there. The other part of interaction with the user is this little slot right here. You need coins for this whole system to work. And so, actually it only accepts quarters too. Um, you have to place the quarter in here, and once it passes through a sensor that's inside, it will make this whole system go live, and you have approximately 30 seconds to pick up a candy. Um, it'll let you know when the 30 seconds starts, is that when you insert the coin, it will move slightly forward. Here's a demonstration on how the uh, coin sorter works for how the system um, activates. We'll start with the smallest coin, a dime. As you can see, it was rejected. Now we'll try a penny. As you can see, that was rejected also. Here is a nickel which is slightly smaller than a uh, quarter, which you can probably see, it's probably about 1, 1.5 millimeters, um, smaller than a quarter, so I'll put that in. See, that was rejected. And now we'll place in a quarter. And as you can see, here you can hear it. Um, it was activated. Now you can move the claw as so.